So welcome back aliens, this is Navin Jaiti from Tavisco Learnings and in this video we'll talk about investment. In fact, you know when, when you talk about investment, it is like investing money somewhere so that what you will get is return of investment, right? So whenever you invest anywhere, maybe, maybe in stock market, maybe buying a new house, right, by buying a new property. So what you want in return is money, right? So when you, when you buy some stock, what you want in return is a, a good rate for that stock. When you buy a property, again, when you, when you want to resell it, you want a good, good money from that, right? That's why we invest. But then, why do we invest? Again, for money, right? But then, what is the advantage of it? First, you will get rich because we want to get rich. That's why we go for investment. Uh, since we want to have a secure future, example, let's say if you, now you are young, but let's say after 20 years, 30 years, when you go, grow old, you need some money for yourself, right? To spend your life, remaining life. Then that's why you need money. But then we forgot in one thing. See, there was a time, you know, way back when people used to do hard work. So their income, so their income was depend upon the hard work they do. But time, I mean, the current trend is not hard working, it is smart working. You have to do lots of mental work compared to your hard work. So initially, I mean, way back, uh, 100 years back, when you want to say you, you can earn more, you have to do lots of hard work. I'm not talking about, let's not talk about 100, let's say 300 years ago, right? So you have to, you have to work hard to earn money, right? But nowadays, you have to work smart. The more you work smart, the more you will have your mental work. Because the, the, I mean, you earn because of your mental work now, not, not because of your hard work, right? So programmers, let's say if you're a very good programmer, if you can build something very great, you will earn more, right? So that's how, that's how thing goes, right? You have to, you need to do lots of smart work. It's your mental, mental thing. It's your, it, it's your ideas. It's your mental work using which you will earn. So, you know, when I talk about investment, my, in fact, my family, my friends, they talk about investment with me and they, they ask, do you even, do you even, even have a, a name? I mean, this word investment in your dictionary. But then when I think about investment, I don't do investment. I don't have any, any investment anywhere, but then I invest in something else. So for me, the definition of investment is something different, right? And that investment. So when I say I want to invest somewhere, I want to improve my skill set. So let's say time being I'm working on some level. So when I say I want to go for the investment, if I have a certain of amount of money, if I have certain amount of time, I need to invest that money and time in such a way that in future I will be having a greater skill set so that I will earn more. Again, it's all come down to money, right? But then for that, we, what you also need is a good skill set. So if you have a good amount of skill set, you will be having lots of knowledge, of course, because if you have a skill set, you will be having a job satisfaction, right? If you are doing a job which you know and which you are good at, you will enjoy it, right? Example, if you are a programmer, let's say if you got a job as a programmer, and but then you don't know these things which are required to be a programmer, you will not enjoy it, right? Let's say if you are a tester, if you, if you went into automation testing and you don't know how to test a software, what's the use of that? You will not enjoy your job. But if you have a specific skill set, you will enjoy it, right? So why improving skill set is important? First reason, you want to earn more. Second, you want to satisfy with your life, right? You want to satisfy with your job. The third thing is respect. The more you go up the order or up the ladder, you will be getting more respect, right? Again, it's also depend upon your experience. Let's say if you are new to industry, you will get an ex you will get a respect as a fresher, right? And they will not expect you a lot from you. But then let's say if you have experience of five years or six years, if you still don't know some technologies, then there's a, there's a matter of respect, right? They, then people will think, why to respect you if you don't know anything, right? So as your experience grows, it, it also increases your responsibility of knowing more things, right? So that's, that's why you have to improve yourself every day and every month right now how to improve yourself and that's why you have to invest i mean not just money it's also about time so do some investment of time on your skill set maybe every day one hour maybe in a week you can use your weekends uh, don't spoil your weekend okay enjoy your weekend plus i mean if you can do one extra hour of work one extra hour of your improving yourself i mean when i say improve yourself it's everything you have to improve your communication you have to improve your a body language you have to improve your skill set your mental skill set you have to be master in the in the field which you are working on so improve yourself that's very important right and that's why i say invest in yourself invest in your knowledge okay investing in stock market property that is important i know but also invest in yourself also investing on your skill set 
so i hope you want to be somewhere in in some years right i mean of course you are happy with your current whatever you are doing currently but in future what you if you if you're doing the same job in future that will not be you'll you will not feel that happy right so what i would suggest from today improve yourself so that in future you will achieve something which you want to achieve okay so invest in yourself start working today invest using money invest using time investing invest using both improve your skill set so if you have some more queries about investment from where to invest what to learn uh, what not to learn i mean there is everything you can learn everything right so if you have any more queries comment in the comment section or you can also join my live sessions which happens every sunday if you have some more questions mostly uh, every sunday will be having the live session in the evening so if you are if you have any questions do let me know thank you so much for watching